Hey everybody, it's Jason with Epson. And we know a lot of people are working at home right now, or learning from home, or teaching from home. So we wanted to just take a few minutes and show you how you can use an Epson document camera to quickly connect to your computer and use it with a video conferencing software. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna connect the document camera itself. So it's just a USB cable. I'm gonna connect it to my PC, plug it right into a USB port. Once it connects, I'm ready to go. So I'm gonna start a Zoom meeting like you would normally start a Zoom meeting. So I invited my friend Veronica here and we're going to start a meeting. So down in the lower left-hand corner of your Zoom session, you'll see a start video button. And right next to that, there's a, a up arrow. So I'm just gonna click on that up arrow and you should see the cameras that are available to you. On mine, I have the camera that's built into my PC, and then I have the Epson document cameras, but this would work with any of our document cameras. So I'm gonna start off, I'm gonna connect, I'm just gonna click on the document camera, and it'll take a few seconds and the document camera will connect. Once it's connected, I can start showing uh, documents or objects under the document camera. That's what you use a document camera for. But the great thing about document cameras is that you can also rotate the, the camera itself up like that. So now I can lecture in front of the document camera. So if you have a whiteboard or some other, uh, like an easel, something that you wanna show, you can do that and lecture in front of the camera. And one more great feature about Zoom or any of these softwares is you can you can actually switch back and forth and it will cut back to me on my uh, PC. So now you're seeing, you're seeing me and my PC screen here. Um, and then I can switch back and forth to the document camera. So I'm gonna rotate this back down. Let's say I'm doing a lesson. I wanna to talk to my students and then I want to switch back to the document camera quickly. Well, I've just cut quickly right back to the document camera, and then I can come back to, to myself. This is an easy way for you to get out from behind your PC and use the technology that's available to you to teach uh, or work more effectively from home. Thanks very much and take care.